Hey dude guys, you welcome to- <laughs> Hello guys, welcome to another developer commentary video thing. Uh, also I just noticed that it's just there. I guess I never removed that. That was probably back when I uh, never did custom uh, reticles, I guess. And they always went to every single cutscene because I was lazy. Not lazy, I was dumb. I couldn't figure out anything. I was not very smart. Oh, we made it to Count Warlock's castle. Wait, here is it no surprise. You know, who cares? Anyway, I'll go inside alone. If anything bad happens, I'll ring the bell. Count the castle. Single for help. Got it. This guy's an idiot. Why would he go alone? He could have gone to this whole party. I mean, they literally could have just gone there themselves and just killed the guy. I mean, they, they figured he was in here anyway, so they, why didn't they just kill him at the start bunch of fucking idiots <laughs> oh, my kicks are so bad <sighs> I still love this game though. Even if I cringe at it a bit. It's been a long time since I've actually played this game. And this was a first attempt at doing random gen, like the walls sometimes being closed, sometimes opened. Actually, that was kind of cool that I attempted that back then. And honestly, I want to. Oh, that's blocked too. I want to start getting better with RNG in my games. I feel like I'm not very. Uh, Great at it, as you've seen with Doomy in the room, I mean, it's sloppy random generation system. Look for smoke. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck off. And you're already awake. Come on. Give me a second! Uh... Fuck. Oh. Oh, that's right! Back then, I used to use those, uh, cast waypoints. So if they touched the box, they would just leave. I love that. That was when I was really sloppy at making AI. I'm still kind of sloppy at making AI, but not as much as I was back then, at least. You know what? This was a good game. It's an... <laughs> Alright, sorry, I'm not gonna start. <laughs> Open the chest, you bitch. Oh, that's right, I have to go around. Stupid walls, dumb random gen. Spider's already out. Ladder rungs, that's right. This is the worst random gen, holy shit, every wall is blocked. This whole place is a damn maze. Ladder rungs. I don't remember my spawn, it's been so long since I've played this game. It's so dark, it's so dark and there's so much stuff all over my screen, I can't see nothing. What are the rungs? Uh... Where are the rungs, dude? Dude, where are the rungs? I don't understand. I've gone everywhere. Did I miss in a room and I was just an idiot and overlooked it? I mean, I am kind of dumb and I do overlook stuff a lot. Damn it, dude, I'm so hungry. I can't eat food. Ugh. Got a bowl of cereal next to me that I can't eat because I decided to record this in the morning because I'm like, <sighs> Excuse me. I'm like, oh, you know what? You should probably, you should probably record something. You know, it's been a while. I haven't uploaded in a while, and I, oh, come on, dude. And I, um, I agree. I should, I should, you know, record. And I should get things done today. But I also would like to eat food. I don't know why. David is such a cunt. He doesn't like to let me eat food. Dude, oh, you should record videos. You should work. Do this and that. Just, what food? No, I put off food. Like honey bunches of oats is great. It's a fine meal. It's a fine breakfast. I eat, I eat it without cereal, by the way. I mean, people people eat cereal with milk. Why? Why do people eat cereal with milk? I don't understand, dude. People are weird. People are weird, you know? Also, I hate this part because I don't remember anything. Like, I kind of remember where the 
Let's... What are you doing here? What? Nobody turn around! You went that way! Okay, fine. Okay, it's below me. Yeah, I should have gone this way instead, but no. What? Oh, that's right, I forgot about that. I know Sratu's always on your tail, because that's part of the game, you know, you gotta... Gotta keep it tense. Oh, why are you blocked? Why are you here? Stupid random gen. I thought it was supposed to have every wall open and stuff. When the second map starts, or is everything just random? At all times. Yes, I know how to kill Nosferatu game. I'm the one who made the- Oh, you fucking prick. This game. Why? Also, your actions angering Nosferatu don't matter. It's just words. I was gonna actually make it affect the speed, but I don't know why I didn't. Probably because I was dumb and didn't know how. Wait, which story is it? It's this one. Okay, last one. I don't remember where that is. It was somewhere upstairs. I think on that side of the house. Castle. The house. I just can't wait to beat this so I can eat food. Uh, five minutes? That's not enough time. Oh, such an easy game. Damn! There they go. Wait a minute. He rang the bell. It took them seven minutes to get to the castle to rescue him. It took them seven minutes, and if he survived that long, why didn't they all just come in there? and kill him, or is it just too many monsters roaming about that are just like, oh, we should get out of here, there's a spider, there's Frankenstein. Did you bring any weapons? Did you bring a fucking gun? Or a, a pitchfork? Or just a sword? These people are so useless, they don't know how to do their jobs. Anyway, uh, that was gonna be a short developer commentary, because there's nothing really else to do in this game besides get the other ending, which is gonna take seven minutes of waiting around, which I sure don't feel like doing. So, yeah. Again, uh, did talk about nothing about this game i guess i should now since it's, it's the end of the video uh back in development you were gonna have a torch then i changed it to a lantern because dracula's castle had a torch that game never finished so it don't matter whether or not i had a torch or uh or a lantern also those torches on the walls that's the exact same model from dracula's castle uh you know i re i like to reuse assets when i get the chance to reuse an asset I'm gonna reuse it. Why wouldn't I? Chair? Why would I make another chair model for a different game? Just reuse the chair! Or just uh, touch it up a bit. Maybe have like three different chair models or four or whatever. That's good enough. You don't need to have a friggin' a different looking chair in every game. That's the thing I don't understand when people are like, uh, fucking, like, you should uh, have like different assets. Oh, why are you reusing these assets in this game when you use it in that game? Why wouldn't I, dude? I mean, it's the same asset. Like, it's a chair. I'm gonna reuse the chair, it's just a chair model. A table? Sure, why not? I'll reuse that too. Like, worth it has the same table models I've been using for the past two or three years. Because why wouldn't I use it? You know, it's a table. It's just, it's just a table, you know? And sometimes I'll make a new asset. I've done that before. I'll make new props or whatever. But I have no reason to make a new chair or a new table or what have you for every single game, considering that I release one like every three months or so. Sometimes it takes longer than three months because I've been, you know, to try to make my games better, I guess, and taking my time with them. Also, uh, something else to elaborate on. <laughs> like, I could just, you know, I like to take my time when I make stuff sometimes. Like with Vex Clock, I'm gonna be honest with you. I have this one map there. Like, I just, I haven't worked on this one map for like three days. I've been doing random stuff. Like, I'll just spend three hours of my day just making these new animations or like new enemies or just random touch ups and stuff and then barely touch the map. And it took me until yesterday to finally start working on that map. And I'm already like halfway done with it. I'll probably finish it today. I don't know. But 
that's basically the thing with game development is that sometimes i'm not always working i guess like eight hours a day or something like that like if i'm like really into it like i was with scooby horror arcade i was working on the game like 12 hours a day for a whole month but with this game i'm kind of slow with it so sometimes i'll work a five hour shift sometimes i'll even just work like three hours or something and play games all day because they I just I lack creative inspiration sometimes. I just don't want to do nothing. As basically how it is with game development is that you don't want to always work your ass off every day. Sometimes you just want to spend an hour working and just enjoy the rest of your day. Because sanity and stuff, you know, uh, that's just that's how it is. I'm not upset or anything. I'm just, you know, elaborating on the work experience of game dev. And that uh, the reason sometimes games uh take longer than they should is mostly just because you don't want to work you know sometimes you just want to take three days off or just barely do anything and you just want to play games all day sometimes you just want to play Masashi samurai legends three hours and then eat food and work a little then go and play something else and then watch anime and then sleep this was an interesting developer commentary anyway um yeah, that's the end of that. I'm gonna go eat food. Thank you for watching. Uh, thank you for tolerating me and my random nonsense that I spout out in every one of these videos. I just like to go on tangents. And uh, yeah, uh, thank you for watching and goodbye.